flood has been a part of our ecosystem before the evolution of humankind. Flood water brings huge amount of mud, debris, boulders, wooden logs and demolition waste from its course which results in loss of human lives and property. Due to climate change, a rise in trend of flood events has been observed. Central Water Commission is maintaining the repository of annual flood damage since 1953, which indicates annual average human lives lost as 1,656, cattle's loss to be 92,554 and economic loss as 7,300 crore rupees. It includes 2 to 3 percent of total population affected and 2 to 3 percent of total area affected of the country. Total damage to property turns out to be 19,440 crore rupees after price adjustment. Central Water Commission is the nodal department for flood forecasting, which is the most cost-effective non-structural measure of flood management. It enables the disaster management authorities to shift people to safe shelters much before the flood disaster. Central Water Commission Flood Forecasting Network has grown from one station to 325 stations in past 60 years. It includes forecast on 197 river locations and 128 dams locations. River Measurement For effective flood forecast, we need river water level, discharge in the river, rainfall, and river topography. River water level and discharge are continuously monitored using standard as well as state-of-the-art equipments. Rainfall data is collected by Indian Meteorological Department and Central Water Commission all weather stations. River topography and cross sections are measured before and after monsoon season. These data are collected both manually and using sensors. Manually collected data are entered in a common platform named eSwiss whereas sensor data is transmitted to earth receiving stations via satellite data is decoded and further transmitted to corresponding modeling center how forecast is generated the uppermost cwc station is considered as base station when the water reaches to base station it alerts the downstream forecast stations based on the travel time and river topography forecasting stations calculate river water level in advance Flood Monitoring and Modeling Regional modeling centers analyze the data and issue forecasted water levels and inflows in the reservoirs in their region. At the same time, Central Flood Control Team and Headquarter keeps a close eye on nationwide flood situation with dedicated officers working 24-7. A separate Central Flood Modeling Team generates advisory forecast for next three days using global satellite rainfall product, numerical weather predictions from IMD advanced modeling techniques and high-end computing systems. Dissemination These forecasts are issued on CWC websites as well as on various social media platforms like Facebook, WhatsApp, Twitter on real-time. Recently Central Water Commission has entered in collaboration with Google for providing real-time inundation forecast for major cities. All these alerts are used by NDMA and other disaster management authorities for timely evacuation of people. Forecasts are generated well before the actual flooding and are circulated in public. Timely response to these forecasts has saved many lives in severe floods.